Well, I thought I'd give you an update. I went to see a ophthalmologist today. Uh, the news I got wasn't great. It wasn't bad. It just was there. Um, I had an, a hemorrhage in my right eye uh, of a vein or a couple of veins. And because of that, my right eye has started to grow extra veins in the gel inside the eye. That's what's causing my vision problem right now. Uh, I'm looking through the veins is basically what it is. That's why I see hairy-like stuff uh, in front of my eye. And it's like looking through a frosted glass right now. Um, my right eye, I mean my left eye, the one that's affected by the Bell's palsy, is fine. Uh, it's, uh, I was able to read the eye chart right down to the small type. I might have missed one letter, but, uh, I, on the smallest type, but, uh, I, I could see really, really well. I have an, uh, uh they've made a, 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 uh, an appointment with a retina, uh, specialist in Bozeman, which is, uh, near here, and, uh, Bozeman, Montana, and, uh, I've got a friend that's going to drive me over because, he said something about they may have to inject something into my eye uh, to do what I don't know. But uh, anyway, we'll see what happens. Um, this next week I'm going to be working on that Indian you saw me working on in my last uh, two videos in the gallery. Um, it will be going to the foundry to be cast into bronze and uh, I need to get a solid bid on the bronze so I know how much it's going to cost to produce it. Um, so I've got somebody that's going to take me over this next week. Uh, I've got to work on that clay starting Monday. I won't be picking up the clays from the gallery until Sunday. So I won't be able to work on the clays until next week. Um, I'm also going to be uh, starting a portrait of a friend of mine who uh, passed away a couple months ago. Uh, they're going to have a memorial service for him at the gallery uh, on the 16th of this month, which means I need to uh, get busy on the clay and uh, try to get it to a point where he's recognizable. And uh, so I'll be working on that too. Um, I had a hard time seeing the clay in the gallery as I was working on it because I couldn't see detail. And that's because the lighting in there wasn't, uh, you know, wasn't great for one eye. It was okay for two eyes, but I don't have two eyes. So anyway, <laughs> I've got better lighting here. It's brighter, and uh, I've also got my magnifiers that I can wear if I have to. <sighs> Just take one day at a time. That's all you can do. All right, well, that's uh, the update, and uh, I'll keep you guys informed as time goes by. Uh, the vision seems a little bit better. I I was having a hard time for a month, two months, even looking outside, uh, especially on a bright day. I, I, I mean, I literally could not see I, without uh, squinting my eyes uh, horribly. <laughs> but now I can actually uh, go outside with my glasses on with no problem. So things seem to be improving a little. Um, I'm able to read my emails better uh, with a white background that uh, emails come with. Uh, it used to blind me uh, for a long time, but uh, it's, uh, it's all, I mean, you just gotta live with what you got. And uh, if it improves, I'm fine. And I'm going to be happy, but if it doesn't, then I'll just learn to live with it. All right, everybody. Uh, love you all, and uh, have a great weekend, and I'll see you next week.